Hello everyone. This video is going to be about what's going on for me lately that is important. Let me start with forgive me my one of my cats is being noisy. But anyhow, I have had a lot going on with spending time with family and doing stuff like that. I had my birthday. I spent that with my terminally ill uncle. Did a lot of things like that. So I haven't made a video in a little bit. I'm sorry. I'm going to attempt to get back to releasing a video for every Wednesday for 9 a.m. Eastern time, which is my time zone. These that you see, even though I got new glasses a year ago, my eyes had changed significantly. The frames my mom bought me for my birthday ODSP paid for the lenses, even though I had just gotten new ones the year before, because my eyes had changed significantly. Then, I also have been applying for jobs. I don't know if I've told you guys about that. I will check and see if I've done a video on this because I know that if I haven't, I need to because you can now take and you can, instead of being able to make $200 a month working before you lose 50%, of your income, not, yeah, of the work income after 200, like if you make $300, you keep 200 and then you'd lose 50 out of the, the three, the third hundred, but they've changed that now. So now a single person, I'll have to look it up for couples in that. I don't know what that is right now off the top of my head, but for a single person, you can make up to a thousand dollars a month, but after a thousand, they don't take 50%. They take 75% and you only get to keep 25%. But for it's good and beneficial for those of us that can work some because it helps those of us that can work some to be able to bring ourselves closer to the poverty line or above. As well as it gives us a better ch like chance to actually make some money if we do are able to work some. Because if you work, can work a little bit and Whoops. And you're making, working part-time, only being able to keep the first 200 as a single person, that's not a lot of money. A thousand, that is. Now, I've been not working since September 1st because I stopped delivering the papers because it was aggravating my fibromyalgia, the delivery people were delivering and blocking the door and not telling me putting it at leaving it in puddles or in the rain or snow so I stopped so that's September October November December January February six months now I've been jobless and it's just about yeah almost March 1st and That'll mark exactly six months since I've had a job. 
it'll be going into my seventh. And I've been going on Indeed and working with March of Dimes to try and get a job. Another job. A part-time job. So I applied through Indeed to multiple, multiple places. Like I, I've been putting my resume out and putting my resume out over and over and over and over. And that's what it takes because you've got to find that right one and there is a decent amount of competition. So I put in my resume for two different job positions at a Tim Hortons in Ancaster. That's a little ways from me, but not too bad. So I got a text today on Tuesday, the 28th of February, telling me that they went over my profile and my information and they liked what they saw. So they want to do an in-person interview. Now I have a March of Dimes person that's going to be helping me t on tomorrow, Wednesday, the 1st of March at 1 p p.m. to do preparation to be ready for the interview, which I have at 11 a.m. on Thursday. So if I know by next Wednesday, which I should, I will do a video letting you know how the interview went and whether I've gotten the job or if I'm still in the job hunt. Please pray and think about me that I get the job. Then I can start paying off like my credit card, get it. And then I have two other things in collections that I want to get paid off so that I don't have it in collections anymore. Then I want to get another PlayStation 5 because I had to give that one back, the one I had. And I've got my rent-to-own companies paid off. And after that, I want to save up. And once my credit card's paid off and that, then I want to save up and start getting things to get a service dog to train a small service dog for my anxiety and get preparations for that. So, yes, please pray and think about positive things for the interview. If you have any questions about the newer work allowed things that you're allowed to do on ODSP to work, please let me know in the comments below. Please like and subscribe. Enjoy. I am so thankful to every last one of you. I am really close to having 180 of you who are subscribed to my channel and enjoying this information, asking me things and informing me of things as well, teaching me. So let's keep doing that and helping each other and being respectful and polite and sharing because that's how we're all going to help different people have different ideas and different knowledge that if we all share and network it together it's going to help please stay positive and be well and hopefully we'll have good weather soon peace much love Bye-bye for now.